Hello everyone, it's Andrew and today I want to tell you how to enjoy Insurgency to its fullest. And it's not gonna be a tip like I always do, and it's not gonna be a mod that the community made. It's gonna be an invitation. An invitation to enjoy the up and down on Insurgency. Many people say when you first start playing Insurgency, you're gonna die a lot of times, that is true. But many players included me, don't get frustrated by dying when you first start playing because you're new to the game, you know that you need to learn a lot of things because before you're able to you know, compete with other players so you don't get frustrated but when you get a basic of understanding of the game you keep dying, you don't understand what's going on that's when frustration comes in because you don't know if you're actually improving so you start a uh, little bit uh, raging you start blaming your team, you start insulting all the players because they're not on top of the scoreboard like you do. What you need to understand is the up and downs that you see on Insurgency are what makes Insurgency great. In Battlefield, you don't care, or in Call of Duty and a lot of other games, you don't care if you die because you're gonna spawn very easily and most players in those games care more about their points unlocking the next gun than playing for the team and winning the objective. In Insurgency, when you die, it's gonna be frustrating because the only reward you get in Insurgency is when you kill somebody or when you win the game and you do something great. And when you do the something great, the reward is so amazing that you get a little bit attached to that uh, reward. But you need to understand this is not always possible. That's why Insurgency is great. You need to push yourself. So the more you play, the more you go through those bad times, the more you're going to improve. The problem is, if you start blaming your teammate, if you start blaming even yourself that you're not good enough, you're not going to achieve anything but getting angry and wasting your time, not enjoying the game. But if you try to learn from your experiences, if you try to understand that sometimes loss is inevitable, that sometimes the team you have against you is better, you will enjoy the games for what it is, even if you lose, if you win, you don't care. So the more you go through the bad times, the more you will have the good times because you're going to improve, and the more you're going to enjoy them, because you realize this can't happen always, you know, you can't always be on top of the scoreboard and winning, especially if you're playing competitive match. So, you want to improve with your team, you want to do your best, enjoy the game in the meanwhile. You, you don't want to always focus on winning, 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 me, me, me. Once you go around with this mentality, you will see that you will enjoy the game even more. And uh, in real life, also in real life, when you go through the good times, you know, you got a beautiful girlfriend, you have your job that you always dream of, things are going great for you. It's easy to say the life is beautiful and uh, when things are going good in Insurgency it's easy to say this is the best game ever, I love it. But you need to understand that every time you're having a good time, somebody else is not having the good time as you. So you can't always have the good time, the good time, the good time. Sometimes somebody else is gonna be you know, the one on the top of the scoreboard, the one winning the match, the one with a better team, the one winning the, you know, a competitive match so you need to understand that there are other human beings on the other side and sometimes they're gonna have a good time and you're not gonna have it but don't mean doesn't mean that you need to rage or insult your team or you know blame the game it's just the way it is what makes insurgency unique and uh, I was telling about real life how when everything goes good it's easy to say that it's great but when things go wrong that's when you see the character of Plevo People that, you know, give up or people that get depressed when things go wrong or people that, you know, blame other people. That's when you see people for who they really are. So those bad times will define you and will make you improve if you manage to not judge them and keep going, just enjoying what happens despite if you win or not. So guys, I hope this video helped you a little bit. This frustration is the reason why we're not gonna have millions of players in Insurgency, but that's why we're gonna see just players with character, with a lot of maturity, and at the same time, people there have a good sense of humor and understand how this game really works. 
So thank you guys for watching and see you in the next video.